start with the fact that it's really nice to co-found and co-own a real estate venture. And it's nice to work for a public company and it's good to own stock, but it's altogether different when you're a founder and a co-owner. So I'm thrilled about the fact that I really do have my name on the door in a way that's it's good for the industry, it's good for the people that I brought over with me, and it's certainly good for women. And so I'm really, really proud to, that that's a big part of it. That was an important quest when I set out to do this, was that I would really truly have ownership. On top of that, I found partners in Rob and Dave that are like-minded, they have a very bold vision, they have an appetite for risk, and they have capital. And I've been capital constrained for some time. Pacific Park's been a story about limited capital investment going forward. And so with all the headwinds associated with that project, I feel like I have tremendous tailwinds that are lifting us up and driving us forward into the future. No first stage jitters at all. In fact, we've already started working. The transition's already begun. The inbounds are insane. Our website had 2,000 hits from the day, we, the day we made the announcement. And so we are being unleashed as we speak. And tonight is an interesting night because of course this is all of our peers in the industry are here. So it wasn't timed this way, but it's an excellent way to get the word out. My first love is office development, building the New York Times building, and then moving into hotels. We built two hotels in New York City. And obviously multifamily has been a big part of my work in the recent past. And I believe New York's resiliency and the fact that the job creation phenomenon continues. It's really the price of land that's created issues because the land is priced to build condos and I have no interest in building condos. I'm interested in long-term value creation. But more importantly, we're not catching a wave. Uh, Dave, Rob and I are all like we're building through cycles and when markets correct and there are downturns, there's tremendous opportunity for folks like us because we, we look for ways to pick up land, to put together projects that take a very long time so that when the cycle comes back you're ready. And so I like it is that we're going to hit all product types. We can be extremely opportunistic because we know how to build so many different types of buildings. And on top of that, we're in the greatest city in the world. So I think they're going to be short-term um, big wins. There's going to be low-hanging fruit. And they're going to be those long labors of love. And remember, public-private partnerships has been a big part of my career. And that's something that I think, again, when markets shift and downturns happen, the public sector steps up and there's tremendous opportunity. So I'm bullish. I'm bullish because I'm really in it for the long haul.